Good morning guys, it is wedding day. Kevin and Deidre are getting married. Um, I just finished the cake up and we have to take the kids over to my mom and dad's so that I can get this done. Um, and I'll just show you the cake quickly. I did a full video on it, um, making it. If you haven't seen that yet, I will um, have that link below and in the iCard. Um, there it is. That's what the wedding cake looks like. And the cake pops. So there we go. So that's what we're doing. Um, we actually have to come back and get the cake in between the ceremony and the reception. That way it doesn't melt and that type of thing. So it's just better if it's not sitting there the whole time. So we gotta do that. Um, Kyle's just getting baby girls in her chair and We'll be ready to go soon. So here we go, wedding day. Okay, we're at Nanny and Papa's. Hey guys, hey dude, what do you think? Daddy has gotten most of the forms off the concrete. Looks good. And can I go across this? I guess I'm going to. Drop my new camera. <laughs> and we did, I'll show you. We did this. We scribed out the plywood so that it would have their names. It's so cool. It looks so good. And then I put my mark there, Kyle's mark there, and then mom and dad's is over there. This is what we're wearing to the wedding. I'm just wearing a simple black dress. It's got a cutout in the back, uh, if you can see it. And then a necklace to kind of match Kyle's shirt and then I think he's gonna wear a black muscle tank underneath and then he's wearing these black shorts so that's what we're wearing I'm absolutely freaking out for Deetra right now it's pouring rain and it's like an hour before the ceremony and it's supposed to be outside I know she has a backup plan but it sucks when things don't go your, the way you were hoping so I'm hoping that it's just gonna get it all out now and then the skies will open up because it doesn't look too bad. Like it looks pretty bright. So I hope it works out for her. I have my hair curled. Um, I don't think I'm actually gonna loosen it off at all. I think I'm gonna leave it like curly curly. Got my necklace on and I got my dress on and then I have these shoes um, and they're not the most comfortable. I wore them on my honeymoon. Um, I've worn them to a couple of weddings, but I'm wondering if I should switch to wedges. I can bring wedges because wedges are a little bit more comfortable, um, but you look like a... That's so uncomfortable. Well, I know, but like you can loosen it off a little bit. I guess I'm going to be way too tall for you. Oh, we're dancing. <laughs> oh, sorry, Dee. Come stand beside me. <laughs> well, I'm not too much taller, but... You're fearing to die in those. Yeah, well... I don't know what I should do. Because wedges are so comfy, but they don't look like wedding-ish, right? So... Hi, Miss Hobbies. What are you doing, Miss Hobbies? Hi! What are you doing? Okay, or I have these, so I'll show you the whole outfit together. Cause these I know I can wear all night long and be fine. So, I don't know. Write it in the comments what you think I should do and, or guess what I'm gonna do. It's probably gonna be these ones because they're just so much more comfortable. But I wish I could wear the other ones. Okay. I'm dying. I gotta do my makeup. Makeup is done. Um, I'm taking blotting sheets with me because it's super humid and my lipstick so that I can redo it. Um, and this is the final look. So, sorry about my mirror. It's disgusting. But, so yeah, that's what I look like for this wedding. We're here. We got a good trek apparently to the ceremony in these wedges. And it's still looking pretty dark. It's fitting, but hopefully it holds off. Oh my gosh, look at the mud. 
Oh man. Woo! I'm gonna fall. I gotta hold off. And I had to park somewhere Whoa. where we could make sure that um, oh, I could first? go get the cake. So, oh boy. Oh, oh it's getting nice. Look at this. This is there. our local golf course. My mom actually used to work here. And it looks like it's breaking up. And I'm gonna be out of breath by the time. They got these little signs saying this way because <laughs> not many people know this golf course so and I know the pond is down here because I think that's where Dietra wanted it but it's got to hold off it's clearing hopefully well guys that's it down there I'm gonna fall <laughs> that's it there that was Kevin riding in the go-kart oh yeah we were saying maybe it's good that it's clotted over because we'd all be dying of heat. So, oh man, we still need to set up. We should just see if they need any help. There it is. It's a nice little spot. Seats are starting to fill. should be like. Winston Churchill said this, my most brilliant achievement was my ability to persuade my wife to marry me. Here's a little bit of advice for you guys for a long marriage. Some of you may have heard this before. Henny Youngman said this one time. Here's the secret to a long marriage. We take time to go to a restaurant twice a week. A little candlelight, dinner, soft music and dancing. She goes on Tuesdays and I go Fridays. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you both go together. <laughs> James Dobson, a preacher who has done a lot on family life, said, don't marry the person you think you can live with. Marry only the individual you think you cannot live without. I think that's what's happening here today. Written their own, that's a beautiful thing. So Kevin and Peter, let's hear your vows. You can pass your book here. Like that one time that tree stump was in your way and you tried to drive through it. <laughs> <laughs> that landed you in Sunny Brook Hospital for a week. Where my nursing abilities were put to the test. That week walked closer together than I ever expected. It killed me to see. Not able to roll over or even take a drink of water on your own. 
As you laid in the bed, the poison out of me, you asked me, Kevin, can you do something for me? I said, yeah, of course, anything. She said, I think I have poison ivy in my butt crack. Because it's really itchy and I can't reach it. for me? So the next guy that I am, I did it. That's when I knew there was nothing else you could ever ask me to do. As we stand here now, I found you, my best friend, my soulmate, and my ride or die partner. I promise to commit myself to you and devote my life to you. I promise to love, cherish, and care for you in sickness and in health. Unless the reason for your sickness is that you've just seen our last credit card statement, I realize how much, realize how much money I spent last month. I promise to listen to your thoughts, your ideas, and stand behind every decision and choice you make, even though, even if I don't agree with it. I trust you, respect you, and will never give you reason or thought to second guess my trust or your trust in me. If you face times of struggle and hardship, you can depend on me to support and protect you, no matter the cost. I love who you are, what you do, and how you try to tell me it's your car's fault that I'm changing the brakes every four months. <laughs> you frustrate me, you irritate me, you piss me off. And at the same time, you prove me in ways no other person has done before. And I have fallen in love with you over and over again. Mm -hmm. I promise I will frustrate you, irritate you, and piss you off. And encourage you to take on all our life's challenges and encounters head first. Today I give myself to you. My mind is clear and my commitment is strong. I take you to be my life partner and spend all my days by your side. I knew the moment, from the day I met you, I'd one day call you my wife. You're a hell of a woman, and there's no one else I'd rather spend my life with. <laughs> Kevin, I am proud to take you as my husband. You are my best friend and my everything. Your arms make me feel safe, and your heart has shown me a love I never knew existed. You have proven your ability to care for me through illness and injury. <laughs> you always find a way to make me smile, even when you have been on a shopping spree. <laughs> I, I vow to be your ride or die, <laughs> which according to Urban Dictionary means to be down with your husband no matter what, through it all, the good and the bad. It is not just the name of a bunch of wild guys on four-wheelers. <laughs> <laughs> I promise to always be honest and faithful to you and to always stand by your side, loving you when we're together or apart. I promise to never intentionally hurt you and to occasionally let you be right. <laughs> I will continue to annoy you with things like skin to skin and I vow to grab your butt even when you're old and wrinkly. <laughs> I promise to be forgiving, patient, and kind, and to love and care for you in every way possible. You are the name of my dream, and I can't wait to see what the future has in store for us. Kevin, go a little old with me, the best is yet to be. Mm -hmm. Hug. <laughs> 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 by the power vested in me by the province of Ontario, in the presence of you, the witnesses, and before Almighty God, I now say to you, I say to you, It is my pleasure to introduce to you Kevin and Deidre. <laughs>
cried. Oh, I know. I cried the second I saw her. Look at that, though. It's coming. We are back home, and it is pouring out. And Dietra and Kevin are supposed to be doing their pictures. I feel so bad. I, I wish there was something I could do for them, but you can't really. So we're home to get the cake. Um, Mom's going to come over, help us quickly with that. And then we're going to head out. So... Um, I realized I didn't get Dietra walking down the aisle, and I'm so upset about it. I noticed when we were sitting there at the ceremony, and it, it was, I was so upset. So, you didn't get to really see that. Hopefully, Kyle got it on the other camera a little bit. Um, she looks so beautiful, though. Um, we're so happy for them. Their vows were great. So we got to head back there with the cake. Okay, we're back home uh, We forgot the wedding card. I can't believe it um, And the cake pops are down there. We gotta put those down there still um, The cake is all set up, which is awesome. It went well. Oh, that's like the most nerve-wracking thing I don't think I could do that as a job is take people's wedding cakes because I mean Kyle had to go up quite a step like up into a barn and I'll try and show you guys um, But yeah, I'll videotape when I get there what it looks like sun is out again Woo. Pretty wet This is the barn <laughs> Oh, sorry. That's okay. <laughs> oh, the cake pops. We totally forgot them. There's the cake. April syrup they made from their own trees which is so cute and I can't wait to taste it they're way 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 down there taking their pictures I don't know if it'll even focus they have long games set, set it up set up set up right over there and it looks like it's gonna be okay for the rest of the night of course because now we're inside the barn it's Kevin's truck this big truck. There's a full pig cover for people like that. I'm having a Pompeii. Kyle's having a beer. You've never seen that? No? I've seen one. So this tree that they had at the ceremony, they were both going to pour soil into it, and then they're going to plant it. So I thought that was cute. It's a willow tree, so it'll grow fast, too. I'm good. How did your pictures go? Were you soaked? Oh, we're soaked, yeah. Aww. We didn't finish all the family pictures. Oh, the one that you wanted. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas! Lucas! Look! Lucas! Lucas look, you're in a picture! Austin! <laughs> 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 hey, Austin, you got to pee? Yeah, you better hurry up. You gotta get into the pee section. It's a, it's a group we're pee, all, so. Over there. Hurry up! Oh, hurry up! <laughs> Stay there, Brandon! <laughs> <laughs> Just go for ten. There's Adam. Adam, get the picture. Get the picture. Go. Go, Austin. Come on. Oh, he's dead by himself. 
Oh, it's not it's not it's not I got most of it. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh my god. How many people does it take to put some suspenders on? I draw the line somewhere. Whoa! Yeah, you got <laughs> down your vest. Yeah, I know. There you go. <laughs> and now, introducing for the first time. Kevin put doing stupid. 
She took all the fun out of the <laughs> teacher, as soon as she came into the family, she made herself a home. She was a perfect, perfect girl. And like, literally like the third time she ever came over, she was farting at the dinner table. <laughs> Me and Kevin never used to fight. Me and Deetra, we fight like crazy. <laughs> the, the dumbest stuff. <laughs> but no, no, she doesn't. She keeps us under control. But anyways, <laughs> Deetra, I love you. You're perfect for me. <laughs> I'm my sister. Uh, uh, well, that's about it. And uh, all I can say is today's been great. Uh, rain and uh, everything went perfect so thanks to everybody that uh, helped out and uh, Deetra, so happy to have you as a sister-in-law and uh, I hope nothing but the best. So uh, have a good night everybody. Hey, Deetra, you guys get up and dance or drop your dress. Get up and kiss. Do it again.
question marriage first?
coming. We have people from one end of, of Canada to the other end of Canada here. So that's amazing. And thank you to those who have traveled from afar. Um, also, I would like to first thank my Angeline, who has helped me with so much and reconstructed this wedding dress. And to Linda, Kim, and Linda, Kim, and Doug and Steve for helping cater everything and volunteering their time. That is amazing. And thank you so much for that. And to Billy, Gretchen, and the Pig, it was amazing. And thank you. And to each of you for coming again. Thank you so much. You guys really made our day great. And our parents, both sides, helped with so much. Barb and Joe for. Host, hosting the dinner last night and helping with setting up everything. Thank you. Um, and that's pretty well all I have to say. Is, oh, and of course, this wedding party. You guys have done a lot. And I thank you guys so much. Adam as well. Thank you very much to all of you. Even you guys, you did pull your weight, so thank you. And you don't get me saying anything, so. <laughs>